I, uh, I'm in my 30s now, so I better have some kids, I guess. Uh, all my friends are having kids. They want me to have kids, so I'm not the only one left with a personality. <laughs> I, um, I can't decide if I want kids, to be honest. Like, I'm not that keen on the idea of giving birth, but I am aware that I'm not going to have the option forever, you know, so maybe I do want to get pregnant. But, um, I don't know, it's tough. You have to think about money, don't you? Like, I'm sort of reasonably comfortable right now, but that could all change, couldn't it? If I end up broke with a child, that could make some serious cash on the dark web. <laughs> yeah. It's just good to have a backup, isn't it? So, what are the options? Well, uh, there's adoption, of course, but uh, I'm nervous about that, because, you know, stranger danger. And um, <laughs> couldn't foster, I hate clutter. But I'm just not sure that I can handle being pregnant, all right? And genuinely, I've been so confused about this that my partner bought me one of those, like, fake pregnancy bumps so I could sort of test it out and see what it was like. Now, I found it very obstructive, right? Like, it's a bit harder to sit down, it's a lot harder to stand up, and it is impossible to pick up women at the gym. <laughs> um, I'm telling you, they normally love it when I skip. <laughs> Now, I could be a mum, I think I could do that part, but I don't know, it's just like having babies is like um, a glory hole, you know? I can't put my vagina through it. <laughs> um, my partner would be up for it, she's not freaked out by pregnancy, but then I don't really know how we would ever agree on a sperm donor, because, uh, well, she wants someone who's well-educated, with no mental health issues and a symmetrical face, but I want to have something in common with my kid. <laughs> And that's a tricky brief, isn't it? What do you do? You can't sort of peruse the sperm donors like, oh, late 30s, five foot 11, Danish. It's not bad. Do you have one with like a nervous bowel and fat knees who cries after sex? No one's gonna give me sperm like that, are they? And I can't ask my brother again. I don't get on with my brother, to be fair. I never have, really. Um, he's a... He's the type of guy that would start a fire at a wedding and then say, sorry, I'm not perfect. <laughs> We've all got one, haven't we? He, uh, he calls me Captain Bird's Eye because lesbian, fish finger. Very good, that. No, that is, that's, that's inventive, that is. Um, weirdly, I call him Captain Bird's Eye too because he usually has crabs, so. <laughs> Family ties, eh? 